Good afternoon, folks. <clears throat> I am here today at Foxwoods Casino in Mashantucket, Connecticut. There's my truck parked in a truck staging area. <clears throat> There's a RV truck staging area for uh, Foxwoods Casino. Let me get the camera turned around here. Show you what I want to show you. All right. <clears throat> so this is the entrance off of Route 2. Other side of the road, you can see the signs to Interstate 95 and 395. So this is off of Route 2. There's Foxwoods and the tower down in the distance. Another exit for it down there. Down this way is uh, Hilton Inn. This is Lot 10, Turner Construction, Great Wolf Lodge, truck staging. Let me spin around again. Also known as Foxwoods Lot 10 Receiving. It just says on that one sign. Alright, sun angle's getting a little low. We're getting into the tail end of October. I'll show you real quick. If you go to the right, you go to the staging area for trucks. It'll say so right on this sign here. My truck being the red one over there. And then everybody likes to have RVs here. RV parking. If you're traveling in an RV, you want to come to Foxwoods, this is where you park. So, this is going to be a longer video than I normally do, just because of all the distance I got to cover, ground I got to cover. <clears throat> this guard shack on the right here is where you check in with your truck in the morning before you head down to the uh, casino. They have a guy here that for security that lets everybody know whether they can go down or not this road here is the road we access to go down through I'll give you another look back here at the staging lot which is huge my red truck way down there RVs etc <coughs> It's beautiful, it's fall at this point. We got some leaves and colors in the trees. When you do get authority to go down to the uh, venue, and I'm going down to Great Cedar uh, Showroom, come down this road down here. And I'm glad I'm on my one wheel. you guys a little quicker shorten up the trip <laughs> shorten up this video for you heading all the way down this road this road is gonna be close to a mile long to get down to the venue there's a utility department and administrative offices and a water filtration plant on the way and you parallel alongside Route 2. Come right down through here. There's quite a few things to you go by before you get there. There's a tower through the trees. I haven't been up that tower. One of these days I should probably try it, huh?
There's a fair amount of traffic up and down this road too. There's another receiving dock up that direction. I don't deal with anyways. Some people might. This is uh, Tanger Outlets. Red light and self-parking parking garage and here's the tower got a red light right here right now I guess I'll wait so I don't get run over yep I'll give it a minute See if I can get a green. Probably not. Oh, we will with this guy here. He'll get the light to change for me. Came up from the RV lot. They came up from the RV lot. They'll get that light to change for me. <laughs> Good deal. So as you come down this road, you'll come to this light. And you'll need to go straight through this light. Go right through this tunnel section. To continue up to the docks for the Great Cedar Showroom. And away we go. So you come up here, there's going to be another stop sign. Oh, and there's loading docks here too. That I don't deal with. I don't deal with those either. So you'll come up through to this stop sign here. And even at this stop sign, you'll come through straight. This is the main entrance to the casino. They got something special going on on the road here. Otherwise, you'd continue on the road around this, uh, this front entrance here. It's quite the place. So I'm going to continue up this other street here in a second, as soon as the cars let me. There we go, don't want to get run over. We would bypass this front entrance. With our trucks over on the other side. Come right past this front entrance. And it is one way here. We would come up to this. This do not enter sign on the right. You can see right here. We would park right on this side, generally. And we would go in this entrance here. Receiving dock number two. You'd go in that door there and, and check in. So these are the docks. And as you can see, they've got LED lights inside the docks. They're narrow. And those LED lights help you back in. There's a little bus terminal over on the other side over here. And this bus terminal area, you'll, you'll pull over that way to set up to back in over here. 
and there's plenty of room. You just gotta deal with the traffic. There's always some traffic coming from the main entrance here. Like this Jeep is now. And like I say, you just pull across over this direction to set up. And once you have set up, then it's nearly a straight shot back over into those docks. And that is where you load in for the Great Cedar Showroom. That was the show I brought in today. So, when you leave the dock, you're going to need to turn right. And you can go either side of this median here. It's one way this direction. And as you can see, it says Great Cedar on the building up ahead, overhead. And also it says Foxwoods. Now, trucks, you're gonna wanna pay attention here, folks. Clearance here says 13.4 over two of these lanes. You don't wanna, you don't wanna go under a clearance of 13.4 with your 13.6 trailer. So what you need to do, show you here, you want to pay attention, folks. It says right lane buses only. That is the lane you want to be on. Through traffic clearance, 13-6. Trucks use this lane. Make sure you do that when you come through here. You come up to the stop sign here. And continue going straight. You get by the stop sign. And you want to get over toward the left. You got more construction going on down here. You can go straight down through there like those cars are going. And there's a way to get down around that way too, but you can also turn left right here at this stop sign. Right now there's construction going on here, so it's a narrow lane, so I didn't do that with my truck today. But this will be two lanes again at some point, and you can bring your truck back around this way to go back to that truck parking. When you come back around this way, you just gotta continue to fall around. You can go right straight through the stop sign, sign right there under the stop sign, said camper RV parking. You can come right down through here. It says clearance 14 foot eight. There's a couple of stop signs. You can stay right over in this hotel's line. Come right down through here. Stop sign after stop sign. I'll try to whiz through. There's car parking here, etc. It's painted on the road here. Hotels and exits. I take the lane here that says hotels wait for the traffic to clear and then I come back down through this way gets me right back down to the main entrance here stay in the right lane as you come down here this way going back to the truck parking follow the sign that says Fox Tower And you turn right here and you follow your way right back to that truck parking going right straight down through this road here folks so 
hopefully that tells you everything you need to know for getting into the Great Cedar showroom. All right, folks. It's relatively easy. I'll say you, you couldn't mess it up, but somebody will come along that can. <laughs> All right, folks. Good deal. You be safe. And we'll make another one. Later. If you like my video, subscribe, click like, share with your friends, leave a comment below. Tell me what you think.